What's going on guys? Today we're going to be talking about my workplace AIT again and in this one we're going to be talking about user management. So this is where you're going to give your personnel access to it and then manage the access that you give them. Now I went over this in a previous video a little bit but I'm going to show you how to do it within my workplace and for the most part it's really not much different. So uh, we won't I won't chatter about that too much. Let me go ahead and get on the system and I'll show you how it works. All right, so once you're signed into G-Army, this is gonna be your first page. We're gonna click on home, just like we would any other time from my workplace, plant maintenance, my workplace, and then right here is the user management option. So we're gonna click on it, and once it comes up, you will realize that it is no different than ZAIT, like I showed you in the previous one. So I'm not gonna dig in too much, but I am gonna say that you can monitor who is in those S locs. So you can go in and check it without having to put in a username and then see who all is in that. And in this case, there's nobody else using this option. Now you as a manager or supervisor have the option to put people into this position, but you can also make them an admin. So you can have, uh, if your shop office NCOIC, doesn't have a manager or supervisor rights then you can put them as an admin within it and then they can manage their own personnel within this so that will be useful all right guys like i said this was a kind of short and sweet but i wanted you to see that you can use user management within my workplace to manage your personnel rather than having to go into win gui and use zait and then just kind of like expel on that uh, what you can do within it uh, that's pretty much it for this video. Thanks for watching guys. If it's your first time watching, please go down and subscribe. Give me a thumbs up if you liked the video. Comment if you got more questions. If you haven't joined the team, please go ahead and do so. It helps support the channel and makes it a little easier for me to make these videos for you guys. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.